This is The Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is an Amazon Basics electronic keypad deadbolt. Now, because of their convenience, locks like these have been gaining in popularity, and I suspect that trend will only grow faster as prices continue to drop. This lock costs only $50. But while the convenience and novelty factors are high, it's still important that these be evaluated as security devices, and unfortunately, this one does have a very weak link. The core that comes with it has an open quickset keyway, five pins, and no security features that I've noticed, though I've not had it apart yet. So what we're going to do today is see what it takes to pick into this, and then I will take it apart to show you what's inside. Let's pop that core out, and we're going to use bottom of the keyway tension with a 40 thousandths thick wiper insert, and we're first going to see if we can use a wave rake to open it up. Okay, just a couple seconds of jiggling and we got it open. Let's try that one more time just to make sure that wasn't a fluke. And we got it open again. Okay, let's see what it takes to get this apart. It has a Schlage style screw cap on the back came off easily. Let's get a pinning tray in here. Okay, let's drop these key pins out first. Okay, all of them are standard pins, and they appear to be double-sided key pins. If we look carefully at that, we can see there are huge bevels on both sides of the pins. That means you can put them in either this way or this way, but what it also means is that they are much easier to pick. Let's check out the driver pins. I don't think we'll see any security pins, but maybe something will surprise us. Standard, standard. Nope, looks like we have all standard pins. I suppose the one saving grace is the bidding. It's above average, but nothing particularly impressive. Okay, to put this in perspective, if you buy the cheapest Home Depot deadbolt, it's made by a company called Defiant, you'll find a few spools in it. This doesn't even have that. It's very disappointing. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.